we're just checking in on the fog because we've seen it sort of on and off throughout the week. It was pretty intense and dense yesterday. Today doesn't look as bad, but you know, Jessica, I'm hoping this will clear a little bit here and there as the day progresses. And of course, this long weekend. Oh, Gianna, then I have bad news for you. <laughs> so that, that marine layer is definitely sticking around for us as we head into this weekend's forecast. By next Tuesday, that's a different story, and I'll get to that in just a second. But yeah, heading into this weekend, it'll be cool, cloudy, and a lot more mild all throughout the Bay Area as we head into the afternoon hours. For example, today, right around the corner, we're heading into our Friday forecast tomorrow. But today, notice how much cooler it is off into our inland areas compared to just yesterday. Yesterday, we were close to the triple digits near Antioch. Now we're in the low 90s, and we see a similar trend over into Livermore with 80s all the way up into the North Bay. As we make our way down along the 101 from San Francisco into Redwood City, we jump from the 60s to the 70s, 70s suddenly into 80s, all the way down into the Santa Clara Valley just near San Jose this afternoon. That's also a lot cooler compared to yesterday where we were holding on tight to 90s and sunny skies. But here's what it's looking like at the Golden Gate Bridge. Once again, the marine layer is holding well above 700 feet, just above the Golden Gate Bridge. But we're going to start seeing some gustier conditions and that marine layer kind of just linger around a bit longer today compared to to yesterday during this time and all the way into the afternoon hours. So this is what it's looking like just by two o'clock. We continue to see a very similar trend into the evening hours tonight. Here's what's happening. We're going to cool down a lot this weekend and then we're going to warm right back up into next week with even hotter weather than what we had this week. And this is the reason why low pressure kind of moves in from offshore. That's changing the direction of the winds. It'll drive in more clouds for us this weekend and it'll keep our temperatures nice and mild. But as we take a look at the next seven days, it's not going to last for too much longer. Enjoy this weekend while we have it with these low 80s throughout our inland areas because right around the corner we're jumping up about 20 degrees just within two days. By next Tuesday we're holding on tight to sunnier skies around the corner and triple digits all throughout the East Bay. We could even see some down into the Santa Clara Valley. As we make our way over into the Bay forecast, we also notice that cool down just a little bit more mild though. Mid 70s in the forecast this weekend, upper 80s right around the corner into next week.